Also, welcome back, my friends, to a brand new episode on the channel. Welcome to today's first video, guys. Now, we are just coming to the end of today's farming session. Actually, it's like a midnight farming session. I've been farming the last couple of hours, guys. This is the final base. Before we max out our storages, we've got 11 million elixir, almost 12 million gold, and about 100,000 dark elixir, guys. So we're about to do some of the final upgrades in my base before we actually go to town all 13 but before we do that we need to take this dude on guys so let's start by making the funnel with the electro dragons either side because we're about to penetrate right there with the entire army guys so this is my current farming attack strategy guys we're gonna break it down in a couple of moments but before we do let's quickly just take down this base so check it out guys, the Electro Dragons making the perfect funnel. I think we're about to lose the second one. Yo, we got the Archer Tower, that's cool guys. Oh, it actually survived. Okay, wow, that is awesome. It's probably gonna go down now. And we can move in with the army. So, check this out. I've got one Golem, the War Wrecker, three Ice Golems, and then we've got the King and the other heroes as well guys. So this is a really big tanky army. It actually does so much destruction as you are about to see and then we've got the six bat spells as well guys so let's go for a three star and let's wait and see what happens there goes the barbarian king's ability guys we're gonna put the grand warden's ability and we're gonna come in with the bat spells over on the left hand side next to that inferno tower and wizard tower guys let's see if we can take this entire base down let's just keep an eye on the other troops it's looking good. Bats are swooping in. And we're going to go with our first freeze on that wizard tower. Hopefully we're going to be able to save our poor bats, guys. Let's freeze it again. Check it out. The bats are making their way through the base. It looks like we're going to just about get it. There it goes. And we're going to go with another freeze spell on another wizard tower, guys. But I don't think we're going to be able to clutch the triple star. I don't know. Let's find out. We're up to 78%. Here we go, the Queen's going to take down the Defending Expo. There goes the Archer Queen ability. Can we wipe out the Defending Queen, guys? I think we've got her. There she... Oh no, not yet, not yet. Here we go. My Queen is trying to break through the wall for some reason, guys. I don't even know what she's doing. She's going to go down. The Grand Warden kills the Defending Queen. But look all the loot we've missed out on. We've left so many storages, guys. And I don't think the Grand Warden's going to be able to get them in time. We're going to get a couple of them, maybe. Maybe a couple of shots. Here he goes. Over to the final corner. Taking out that gold storage. But you know what? It doesn't matter. I just realized we've already got maxed out gold, guys. So it doesn't even matter. So, check that out. Taking us to 11.9 million elixir. And we have got enough loot to actually do our upgrades, guys. So... We don't quite have maxed out elixir storages, which kind of sucks, but we're almost there. Okay, so now we've got maxed out elixir storages, guys. Now we've got maxed out gold storages. What we're going to do, we're about to spend this loot, but before we do it, guys, take a look at this. This is my new farming attack strategy. It is this one down the bottom, army number four, and look how cheap it is. 97 thousand elixir guys 418 dark elixir obviously supercell has given us a variety of different events during the black friday discount and the best one is that guys black friday discount get 90 percent off all dark elixir troops and spells for a limited time only so if we actually go into the training check that out guys seven no what is it one dark elixir for a level seven minion that is crazy 12 for a valkyrie but take a look at the golem, guys. Only 49 Dark Elixir. So we have comprised an army of one golem, three ice golems, ten bowlers, seven witches. And it comes to a total, as you saw, of just 418 Dark Elixir. So this is going to help me, guys, max out this base over the, the next couple of days. What are we going to do now? There is still some special offers in the store. The Black Friday pack, guys. 10 million Elixir. Do we buy that? Should we buy that right now? You know what? I think we're going to buy it, guys. Let's do it. Let's get the 10 million elixir and let's see what we can upgrade with it. Hopefully, we've got enough money in our account, guys. Let's find out. If we don't, we're going to have to buy it later on. Yes, we do. There it goes. And we're up to 
point, sorry, 21.9 million elixir, guys. So special offer has been received. Let's get rid of it right now here in the episode. So for anyone that doesn't know, guys, all we need to do with elixir is upgrade the walls. That is pretty much it, but we still have some gold upgrades to do in the base. Now, we've got two builders free, so we're going to get rid of them right now. Check this out. If we edit layout, guys, we've done 74 level 13 walls. We're trying to do all 300 before town all 13 is out, guys. So let's dump 22 million elixir on these walls, and we'll see how many we have at the end of the episode, guys. Check that out. Do not forget, tomorrow, there is a new gold pass, which is coming into the game. And that means we are going to be getting 50 million from the season bank, which is amazing, guys. So we're going to be spending all of that on these walls tomorrow, which is going to take us well over 100 level 13 walls. But there it is. So far, we are almost... I would say we are about a third of the way there, or almost a third, guys. We're closing in on 100 walls being upgraded. So, let's get rid of the gold now. We are upgrading two cannons. Actually, three cannons, guys. And then the rest of them are already maxed out. So now, we need to start on our final defensive upgrade. And that is the Archer Towers. We need to upgrade this entire row. And then we will have completed all the defensive upgrades in this base. And we will be ready for the next Town Hall level, guys. So, 4 million gold. I can't actually upgrade another one. Because I've only got a single builder free. And we need to keep at least one builder free to do the wall upgrades, guys. So, that means we can upgrade some more walls. Which is crazy. Let's go for another three. And that's going to take us to a grand total. Let's just quickly check. Of 87. So, I think we started with 74 at this episode. So, we just upgraded 13 level 13 walls guys how weird is that now what i would like to do to carry on we've almost got enough golden elixir to do another wall upgrade so let's actually find ourselves a live attack guys let's crush a base and let's do another two wall upgrades before we end this episode using my new farming attack strategy now as i said we're only going to be using this over the next couple of days, as soon as the Black Friday discount ends, guys, we're probably going to switch up the attack strategy and use something a little bit cheaper. But for now, my friends, stay tuned and we'll find ourselves our second opponent. Here we go, guys. We have landed on a Town Hall level 12 and it's got just under 9,500 Dark Elixir. Now, for anyone that doesn't know, although we've got maxed out heroes... We still have to do like six or seven lab upgrades, guys. And every single one of those upgrades requires Dark Elixir. So we really need Dark Elixir, like desperately. So when we find bases like this, I'd actually rather take this on than find a base full of gold and elixir, guys. So what we're going to do, Dark Elixir storage is over there. But some of the drills are spaced out around the base. So I want to try and grab as much of this Dark Elixir as possible, guys. Hopefully, we're going to be able to three-star. So, I'm going to come in with the first Electro Dragon there. And I'm going to send the other Electro Dragon in right on that drill to make the funnel, guys. Hopefully, this is going to work. Electro Dragon 1 looks good. Electro Dragon 2 looks like it's going to get killed by the Queen, probably. But before it does, it... Damn. I thought it was going to take out the Wizard Tower and the Gold Storage, guys. But unfortunately, it didn't. So Electro Dragon, you suck. But here we go. Electro Dragon number two. Creating the perfect funnel. And we are good to go. So, I'm going to use the Golem down the bottom. The Ice Wizards in the side. There goes all three heroes, guys. The Witch is at the back. And we'll drop in the Bowlers right behind, guys. Rage Spell's going to go down. Oh, damn, we dropped a Freeze by accident. Doesn't matter, guys. Shouldn't be too much of an issue. And we are going to rock and roll into the center of this base. Let's go with the King's ability. I want all the Witches and the Grand Warden to go into the center, guys. It's almost crucial. Let's now drop in these Bat Spells. See if we can take out the Eagle Artillery. Check this out. It's looking good, guys. I just need to watch the Wizard Tower. I'm going to go with the Grand Warden's ability. I'm going to freeze this Wizard Tower. And hopefully we can take it out before it comes back alive. Yes, we can. Town Hall is still up, guys. And we're going to go with another freeze. Nope, nope, not yet, actually. We're going to keep the Wizard Tower alive, guys. 
We don't need to freeze it because the queen is distracting. Now we're going to freeze the Inferno, guys, but I don't think we're going to be getting that second star. I think I kind of messed up the funnel. But you know what? It doesn't even matter. We still got so much of the Dark Elixir. We did miss that drill. I did forget about that. Can we do 70%? That would be awesome, guys. Getting me a 100% bonus. 68. There's 69. And we're going to get 70 from the gold storage. Okay. Let's end it there. Collect all that money. And let's go back and do some more upgrades. We've got enough golden elixir to actually upgrade the walls again, guys. So let's quickly train up another army. Let's cook ourselves a siege machine. And we can spend the rest on more walls, guys. So this is going to be the final two upgrades of the episode. Taking us to a grand total of 90, sorry, 89 level 13 walls. Not too bad, guys. Hopefully we get to 100 by the end of the day. But now, my friends, we're going to end this episode here. Stay tuned. There will be a second one coming in a couple of hours time.